Let's start. Picture number one. <laughs> Picture number one, and you can see a very determined Anna. <laughs> a very focused one. Um, okay, I know, I know where this picture was taken. Um, here I am playing with white pieces and we can't see my opponent, but my opponent is uh, former world champion Antonetta Stefanova from Bulgaria. And uh, yeah, it was the last round of the Olympiad, a uh, world chess Olympiad in, in, uh, in, in, wait, in Baku. <laughs> I hope. I was a bit confused if it was Baku or uh, Batumi, but I think it was Baku. Because I remember this game was very important for me. After winning this game, I also won the uh, gold medal on the first board. So this game was really very, very important for me. And it was actually a nice game. We, we played Scotch. If you're interested in the game, please find it in the database. We will not go through the game right now. But yeah, it was a very interesting, very intense game and uh, not easy. And obviously there have been a lot of pressure. Our favorite word. There have been a lot of pressure because it's the last, um, it's the last round where everything was decided. And yeah, I'm glad I won that game. Also, our women's team, uh, did well. We finished, we finished third, I believe. I believe that time we finished third as a team. Am I right? And yeah, and the year, the year is 2016. But Tomei Chess Olympia 2016, Anna won gold medal by being the best performer on board one and became the winner of the prestigious Koisa Award uh, as the best female chess player during the Olympia 2016. Actually, the Koisa Award I got, uh, yeah, for the year of 2016, but not just, um, because of this Olympiad, because of, uh, perf because of, uh, having the best performance, uh, on the Olympiad, but also because in 2016, I won, um, uh, uh, two world champion titles. Like, I became the, uh, women's world blitz and women's world rapid champion. So 2016 was really a very good year for me. And, uh, yeah. That's a good start. Good start. Good memories. Let's continue. Next one. I mean, <laughs> I mean, on every picture, the picture is a little bit small, but on every picture, you can see like I am really very, very focused and uh, uh, not that polite as I am uh, on the streams, perhaps. So yeah, here you see me as a d from a different angle. Uh, but okay. Yeah, I'm playing the game. It's definitely, it's definitely, we can say tournament. We can say tournament because I remember this background. Uh, this one, I mean, when you play the vacancy tournaments, uh, there were three groups earlier, like A, B and C. A is for the elite players and they play here in a separate row. B is for Play is played, group B is played here, group C is played somewhere uh, here. And there is also a very big uh, open tournament opened uh, for everyone, I believe. And uh, here are, like somewhere here are the cameras and a big table, which is like separating the A and B group, also the C group and uh, um, the open tournament but in general it's a very nice festival very well organized and i really liked to, uh, to play in the vacancy because um two times i was invited to, to play in the b group and the b group was really very strong both times uh, i was like uh, one of the lowest seeded participants uh, because mainly it was a, a male tournament so so it's definitely we can see. Uh, I remember I played twice, once in 2010, 
and once in 2014. So the big question is uh, which year? Which year? Is it 2010 or 2014? I think it's 2010. I would say it's my first my first uh, year I played in uh, we can say, but it could also be 2014. No, I think it's no, 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 no. In 2014, I think I already had a different hairstyle, so I would go with vacancy 2010. And uh, can we have any hint? Can you have any hint? I mean, there are not so many hints. Uh, we don't. We, we can only see the flags. Uh, flags of England, perhaps Nigel Short, flags of Russia, it could be uh, actually many of the possibilities. This person is not very well visible, the position on the board is also not so visible, but you can notice that I already castled. So king safety, very important, very important, very important, king safety is very important. I would say uh, I would say it's 2010, I played in the B group, in 2010 my sister played in the C group, so it's my, uh, it's my final answer, it's my final answer. <laughs> oh yeah, we can see 2010 group B being the only player to beat Anish Giri who later won, also won the tournament, indeed, indeed, but this game is May can it be versus Anish? Uh, no, I don't think so. I don't think this game was versus Anish, though I played with him um, versus him with white pieces. But I don't think this game was versus Anish. <laughs> but yeah, I won. Uh, I beat Anish uh, in round eight or nine. Right. Uh, we can see the tournament. Uh, that is really very long. There are thirteen rounds. Uh, so the tournament lasts like for three weeks. Um, yeah, if you go to weekends, you have to be ready to stay there for a very long period of time. Um, yes, 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 yes. So next. Oh my God. Oh my God. <laughs> next, next question. Um, I am sure what I am definitely sure about is that this picture was taken long ago. Definitely. Long ago, long ago. Okay, it's me. It's me. Uh, this is Katarina Lakno and this is Nana Zagnitze. And um, I remember this, um, mm, well, it's not the trophy, but, and it's not a diploma, but some kind of, um, award and I got it when I won um, when I showed the best performance uh, also on the first board in the European team championship and it was played in Greece but which year which year it's a big question uh, we are really so young here. We are so, so young here. <laughs> we are so young here. Um, uh, 2010, 2011. Oh, I have played so many. I have played so many European team championships. Um, I think it was, uh, it was, it was, it was, uh, yeah, uh, it was not 2000, can it be 2012? Yeah, maybe, no, wait, 2000, can it be 2000? Because, um, look, one year, one year we have, oh, Ani, thank you for getting to one sub to Nasir. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Um, one year we have uh, Olympiad. And uh, one year we have world and European team championships. So uh, if Olympiads we have in uh, like, uh, how is it called? Like in uh, 2000, 2002, 2004, 2006, 2008, and so on, uh, then in the, Wait, is it odd or is it not odd? I am always confusing this word. <laughs> so then it 
can't be uh, 2012, it can't be 2010, it must be 2011, it must be 2011. The method of em elimination also works uh, here. I think it's uh, 2011. It can't be 2009 because no, it can't be 2009. And 2013, I guess no. I think I think 2011 fits the best <laughs> for this picture. 2011. <laughs> So, um, European Team Championship, uh, 2011, and it's Greece, maybe it's, uh, Portocaras, maybe not, but it's Greece. That's my final answer. <laughs> and, okay, yeah, European Team Championship, 2011, Portocaras, best performance on board one. Yeah, here it is, here it is. What will be next? Aha! Uh -huh. Next is interesting, next is interesting. Uh, here it's me. And actually here it's Nepo, but it's... <laughs> here it's Nepo, but it's not very clear. Here is Vasily Ivanchuk, this is George Mayer. Uh, this is Boris Gelfand. And who is with the, uh, who is, uh, who is playing here? Uh, it may be Peter Swidler. I think it's Peter Swidler, but, uh, ah, yeah, here we can see it's Boris Gelfand and it's Peter Swidler. So, so it was, ah, uh, and here we can see it's Jan Nepomnesi. Uh, here we can see it's Jan Nepomnesi. So it was a very strong tournament in Israel. A closed, um, round robin tournament with only, uh, six or eight players participated there. Just a second. Uh, six or eight. I think there were only six players and uh, we played a double round robin. So I played with each of these players two times. And I remember I made two draws with, I made uh, two draws uh, versus Jan Nepomnesi, I made two draws versus um, Ivanchuk. Uh, I lost two games versus George Meyer, I made two draws versus Peter Swidler and, uh, and two draws versus Boris Gelfan. Uh, so it was a very strong tournament, a uh, very difficult one to play because I was facing many of the um, uh, world-class grandmasters. So it's um, it's Jerusalem uh, uh, 2018. Let's go. On it. Uh, Gideon Yafet Cup in 2018 in Jerusalem, strongest chess tournament of Anna's Korea. Yeah, Grandmaster, Yanni Pomenshi, Vasily Manchuk, George Meyer, Boris Gelfand and Peter Swidler played in it. Uh, yeah, I'm um, very glad I was invited to play there because for me, of course, to face such a strong players was um, a really good um, practice and a good opportunity. Uh, that I could uh, play versus the world's best, best players. So yeah, and I did quite well. I did quite well. Uh, next question. Ha ha ha. Who is this? <laughs> we can read it here, but who is this? <laughs> Lizzie. I think it's good that Lizzie is not here. I think it's good Lizzie is not here. <laughs> Arkanto san you saw the video recently in YouTube. <laughs> but Lizzie is so cute. Look at her hairstyle. <laughs> Lizzie is so cute, yeah. <clears throat> okay, this one is easy. This one is easy. It's a world championship in... Um, a World Blitz Championship in Hante Mansisk. Yeah, nice cookie. I won that game. I won that game. It was a very long game. I had initiative uh, from the very beginning, but then somehow I uh, lost the thread and I didn't play so precisely, though somehow in the end I managed to win. And later on I... Um, I won uh, the my first uh, 
uh, women's world blitz champion title. So this tournament is very memorable for me. I think we don't have <laughs> we don't have uh, to ask Anit if it's true or not because it's definitely Hunter Messi's women's world blitz championship 2014. Uh, yeah, it was the last year I represented Slovenia. I think, uh, uh, like, I changed federation back to Ukrainian right after that tournament. <laughs> it's not like it had the influence, like this tournament had uh, the influence, but this was the last tournament I played under the Slovenian flag. So, 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 next photo. Oh, gosh. <laughs> It's me. <laughs> no worries. Uh, this picture, wait. Um, this picture was taken by... I think this picture was taken by Leonard Oates. Uh, it, it, <laughs> it's a World Blitz um, Championship uh, 2019 where I finished second. Uh, where I finished second, uh, Jorley is a spoiler, <laughs> opponent run away, yeah, and I am a bit confused what's happening. Um, <clears throat> so I think, uh, yeah, picture by Leonard Oates, I think we don't have to guess the year and the tournament, but we have to guess uh, who was um, the author of this picture. <laughs> and who was the author of this picture? <laughs> Uh, not clear, not clear. But yeah, it was World Rapid and Blitz Championship. Uh, in Blitz, I finished second. In Rapid, I finished um, not in the top three, but somewhere very close. And um, as a combination, I actually won the combination. Like the, I showed the best performance for a combined. Um, uh, rapid and the blitz result. So, so that's it. That's it. Uh, uh huh. Uh huh. Uh, okay. It's me. It's uh, Diana Dengler. It's Katarina Lakno. It's Valentina Gunina, it's Monika Sochko, it's Alina Kashlinskaya, uh, it's Inna Gaponenko. Uh, we see a lot of uh, players, <laughs> uh, a big playing hall and um, yeah, cameras. And we can see that the tournament, uh, the tournament uh, it's, uh, is held in Monte Carlo. Um, due to the brochure. Uh, you can also see that I am wearing, um, I am not actually wearing, but <laughs> but I came with a sweater, with a sweater and this is the logo of the uh, Women's Grand Prix, which was also held in Monte Carlo before. Women's Grand Prix was played in 2015 and here at this picture we are playing a um, uh, World uh, Rapid Championship. It's the World Rapid Championship and after that it was, no, not the World European Rapid uh, Championship and then it was European uh, Blitz Championship. And this is the year when I won, when I won the Rapid. This is the year where I won the Rapid and once again you can see I am playing Dutch. Yeah, a very active one. A very active one. Uh, so which year was it? Which year was it now? Uh, which year was it? So it's Monte Carlo, Monte Carlo, Monte Carlo, Monte Carlo, 2017 or 18. I would say, uh, yeah, I won the tournament and I don't remember in which year it was. Um, it's Monte Carlo, um, Monte Carlo, Hotel Novotel. <laughs> um, I think it's uh, wait. Uh, no, it's not before 2015. It's not before 2015. It's uh, it's 
I would say it's 2017 or 2018, but I would say 2017. Maybe I am wrong. Maybe I am wrong, but I think it's 2017. A European Women's Rapid Champion 2017 in Monte Carlo. Okay, good guess. Good guess. Good guess. <laughs> uh next one it's me it's me and it's katakamski it's me and it's katakamski and it was played in um <clears throat> netherlands and this is the only tournament uh where i played games with adjournment i can zoom by the way uh if I can zoom. Oh, I am playing versus Gatakamski. It's the tournament where some of the games were adjourned. The adjournment means that after some uh, period of time, you write your move or your opponent, depends on who, uh, whose move it is. Uh, and it, and then the game is adjourned. Then you go to your room and then on the next game, and then you continue the game on the next day. Uh, so. I did quite well at this tournament and if the tournament in uh, Jerusalem was uh, like uh, the strongest tournament in my career, then I would say uh, this tournament was uh, perhaps the second strongest uh, because, uh, because, because, uh, can we check engine during the German? Yeah, that's why we don't have so many a German tournament these days. Actually, we don't uh, have any. <laughs> we don't have any uh, because of this reason. But uh, many years ago, the tournaments with a Ger uh, like a German tournaments were very popular. So people were coming back to their rooms and they were analyzing not with the engines, but with their head. And uh, and there are seconds. So if you had more seconds, who are strong, that gave you additional um, advantage, I would say. Uh, so 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 this game uh, we ended it in a draw. It was Raya Lopez, and uh, and it was played in two thousand twelve. Uh, on the peak of my rating when I was rated over 2600. Um, I think that's it. <laughs> SP, uh, ACP Golden Chess Classic 2012 in the Netherlands. Yeah, I drew Badr Dubava, Lekwan Lem, Emily Sotowski and Gatakamski and I beat Sasha Kiran. Uh, you mentioned, Anit, you mentioned all the good results, but I lost to Ivanchuk, so I made 50%. <laughs> but you may see that the tournament is really, was really very, very strong. So, unfortunately, I lost to Ivanchuk. <laughs> but yeah, it was also a round robin tournament. It was a round robin tournament with, I think, uh, eight players. Yeah, Badur Jabawa, Lekman Lim, Lusutowski, Gatakamski, Sushi Karan, me, and Ivan Chuk. Yeah, eight. No, and someone else. And someone else. So, uh, someone else. Katya 341 just subscribed. Katya, thank you for Twitch Prime. Ah, uh, no, 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 no. Yeah, indeed, it was seven players and one, um, and one player, uh, had one, uh, one day off. Yeah. So that, that's how it was. So I made 50% because I beat Sasha Kiran in round one and in the last round I lost to Ivanchuk, who, who became the winner of this tournament. You see? You see some of the things you start to remember, <laughs> some of the things you start to remember after, after something. Next photo. Oh, next photo. Next photo. Serious Anna playing, uh, her first, <clears throat> and not only her first, but it was first for many players, uh, candidates tournament in Kazan. I don't know, um, uh, before which round this picture was taken, but it's definitely, um, but it's definitely the candidates tournament in Kazan in 2019. Uh, the winner of that tournament was Alexandra Goryachkina and she uh, qualified to play 
uh, she became the challenger uh, to Zhu Wenjun. Uh, she played a world championship match, which she eventually lost. Uh, but she, but uh, thanks for winning this tournament, she got a chance to play this world championship match, and I finished second. That's why I didn't, <laughs> I didn't play, but Courage cannot play it. Uh, so here I can't be wrong, but anyway, let's wait for Anit to reveal the answer. Uh, women's candidate 2019 in Kazan. Yeah, I finished second between, be, behind, be between, <laughs> between Alexander Gorachkin, Alexander Gorachkin and me, but, but between, yeah, so I was somewhere in between. Uh, next one. Uh, next one is It's Me. It's a uh, Zhuven Jun and it's a uh, World uh, Rapid and Blitz Championship in Qatar. I won both of these sections. I won uh, World Rapid and World Blitz. And uh, the game we are playing right now, I think uh, we are playing a rapid game. A rapid game which... Wait, just a second. I'll check. I'll check. It's Petrov. It's Petrov. It was knight uh, e4, e5, knight f3, knight f6. Maybe I can try to make this um, bigger. Here it's bigger. So e4, e5, knight f3, knight f6, uh, knight c3, bishop b4, and I played knight e5. So it's the position after four moves. It's the position after four moves. We made uh, we made a draw. But uh, but I became the winner. I became the winner. I became the winner in rapid, and then and then I became the winner in blitz. A very um, like a huge achievement for me. A very good moment in my career. So so it's uh, Doha 2016. <laughs> and it's like Hikaru analyzing everything she sees. A women's World Rapid and Blitz Chess Champion 2016 in Doha double gold medal winner. Yeah, right, 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 right.